another you guys food. welcome to camp Brittany. <laughs> <laughs> kiki walker what the fuck? This so when she said that to me yeah it really hurt me happy birthday dear Brittany. Trusting, but you did it. Both low key, but I really know you with it. Why you not shalom when you really got them digits? Friends, this week's vlog is gonna be a little different than I normally do. I really wanted you guys to have the experience of my birthday weekend with me because I really feel like y'all are my friends in my head. So I decided for my birthday that I wanted to spend it in nature, in peace, in harmony. So I invited my closest people out to spend the weekend with me at this lake house. And we just had a great time. It was really healing for me. There was no drama. Um, and I hope you enjoy it. Friends, it's my birthday weekend. So me and my friends have written out this cabin that you guys just saw. I'm turning the big three five. Y'all been rushing today. I had so much to get done. So I didn't have time to fight on my video. So. This is nice. I wish it's Kaylee so friends would do stuff like this. Kaylee yeah. friends? Why isn't it heating up? Oh, I like it higher. Real cute. Oh. Right, this only go up to 220. I bought this little tiny flat and it only go up to 220. I must have been smoking. Y'all, this don't work. This don't work. I should have bought my real flood in. It might just give poopy weed out. I might have to see if somebody else brought a flat iron. That's not working. I think this is good to get with these flat irons. I'm so excited for the birthday festivities. With turning 35, I just wanted to bring it in with like peace and love, no drama, no nothing. So I hope everybody got the memo. Peace, love, no drama. High priority, no drama. So see, I'm gonna put my hat back on because I don't feel like that just did nothing. How do I turn it off? These batteries only go to 220. Oh, I don't know. So I'm gonna put my hat on so I can better figure out the hair situation. Yep, yep, yep. Very cutesy. Very demure, very mindful. I did bring multiple hats. I'm calling my friend Taja because she's driving by herself from South Carolina. Hello? Hey, how far away are you? Yeah, and it's deer, so be careful. Okay, I haven't seen no deer, but I've been having my, like, right lights on. I'm trying to see if I see any. But it's not my birthday working. Alright, goodbye. Okay, all right, bye. So you're seven minutes away. Hello? Hello? I think her cell went out. She had no signal. Whatever. How was the drive, Chelsea? Well, yeah. yeah. Did anybody get water? That's what Tasha's message was. I think that everybody just came at the same time. It's kind of very timely, very nice. Y'all should keep y'all seasoned. <laughs> What'd you say? Y'all should keep y'all seasoned separate since she got a lot of seasoning. Um, right. um, what kind of stuff? I don't know. Huh? Crazy business. The middle room. Okay. Who all in the middle room? You and Chelsea. Oh, we're cute. Baddies. Bad? I don't know. Well, they did have my backpack. Let's see what I'm in the middle of the day. Who brought Kisharet? Y'all, I see. You brought Kisharet? I 
Okay, y'all know this key is notorious for getting lost. Oh, I gotta get this. She loses that key at all times. Yeah, she really? Because it's leaking. Oh, that's You were choking that one. Uh-huh. Oh. Wait, you in the Four bedrooms, so it's like us four up there. Mm-hmm. Right. Four bedrooms. Just for Christmas. Aww. Four bedrooms. 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 Four bedrooms.
his brother oh, to the shit. night in the blues in your left eye. Yeah, he's in the blues. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There's yeah. something yeah. coming up. And Isaiah, Isaiah Washington beat Omar Epps to see. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Omar Epps to see. Oh, 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 Omar Epps to see.
Jay, you have fancy socks, FYI. Ain't they comfortable? Yep. Why Auntie Cortez? Why she not? Huh? I thought you said Auntie Cortez was like. She up. She's in the kitchen. Oh, it's so cold. Jesus. Oh, y'all should go build a campfire or some shit. Picked up my door and I said it's 24. Jay said it was supposed to be at 733. Yeah. So that's why I picked up my door and I'm like, I sat there for a second. I said, I said, there's no sign coming up. And I went back in. Where's my gun? Am I doing this wrong? Yep, you're doing something wrong. It's your thing. You work this D scale me. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, I had to push the K. I don't know how to work that one. Mm. The trimmer. Oh, you have, this is hazelnut? Why that me? Oh, you talking about your tea? Yes, it tastes oh, so good. I don't know about that. Okay, I have to decorate. <laughs> <laughs> so, 
I blow it up when people uh, sleep, Kayla. Kayla, are you still sleeping? Yeah, she still sleeps. But she not snoring for yeah, real snoring. no more. That means you, that's how I know if my husband really sleep or pretending. If it ain't snoring. Oh, this would be a cute picture. Well, we look like somebody's mama. Did you just try to let your shoulder out to be more sexy of on camera? Course. The fuck I look Did like you just say? <laughs> I just said we look like somebody mama. What the fuck? Yeah, My I'm mom saying. is Auntie Nini. I am somebody mama, but I'm Good always morning. gonna be somebody wife. Another day. Another. You coffee. guys, welcome to Camp Brittany. <laughs> <laughs> Kiki Walker. What the fuck this is, is your home away from home away from home. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> they're making fun of my vlog. No, I wasn't. I was very excited. I'm gonna say this like Kiki Walker every time it you see like, me. Welcome to Camp Brittany. It looked like I'm having conversations with my two gay moms. Oh my god, we got it. <laughs> and they're we educating me <laughs> on life this morning. Life this morning is crazy. And we're just having that, that regular conversation. Wait, is it after Karate hours? Are we technically allowed to be? I think that things are 10 o'clock to 10 o'clock. Are we allowed? Mika, I'm allowed. Girl! Kind of sort. Them motherfuckers is all the way over there. Where are good girl? This house ain't did shit since we got here. Yeah. Oh, you there. think nobody there? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not right Somebody's now. Somebody's uh, at the house, like a couple doors. Yeah, down. they was out on the porch mm -hmm. already. Mm -hmm. If somebody making a complaint, cause we three niggas sitting outside. <laughs> that sound like something that's. I gotta bleep that word out so I don't get demonetized. Sorry. I'm gonna bleep that Men word out. Men of color, women of color. <laughs> cause it's three POCs. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Person of color. People of color. She just said POC. Just like you. <laughs> I just Three would, pox. I would, just, I would never call myself a pox though. Because I'm not a person of oh color. I'm an African American. I'm black. Mm -mm. Oh, I got a question for y'all. How do y'all feel about this half of the discord of like people saying that African Americans aren't from America, but Jamaicans are Jamaican? I thought they said... Oh, instead of like they say we're African American. No, no, no. People American. say like, oh, you guys don't know where you're from. Y'all have no history. And then I'm like, we're the same as Jamaicans. We're the same as Cubans. The same way that boats got them there, boats got us here. The only reason that we are something else is because we're African American due to what well, like people technically, technically, mm -hmm. people say Jamaican America. People say are Jamaican like Jamaican. If you were born in America. And you're oh, Jamaican, I guess so, you're South Jamaican America. America. Is, oh. Jamaican American. Yeah, but no, I'm saying like when they say Nobody that like the that. same way that like Nigerians same thing like Nigeria. Haitians. Exactly like Haitians. Like the people from the West from the West Indies never get that like y'all don't know y'all history, but they're just as immigranted as we are. They were still brought here. But I think like they said are. what I've heard, which I don't know if I agree or not, is that they it's have camped a everywhere. lot of their culture we because did. they weren't like but that's not true. As a person being raised first now with hella Jamaicans, they have so much white colonialism that runs through them down to their names. The same way that Catholic, the same way that Asians come here and be like using their Catholic names, so there's hella Christinas and hella Latinas. That's what and Jamaicans Kim's. do. There's so many Denises and so many like names like that, Victorias and stuff, because they use their Catholic names. They are very Anglo-Saxon. Like they have taken lots of that. Do they still do like the same way that we have like voodoo and hoodoo and our own stuff? Yes. But I think that their culture is very much so colonized. Shit, I don't even want to be a baby bleaching and all types of shit. I just call myself black. I don't refer myself as African American. Any of that? Honestly, really, I'm just black. Just so much going on in America. All right, it is very ghetto to be American right now. Send me to Canada without the snow, please. I love Canada when I was immigrate. Me, I would love. What do y'all? What 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 plans do I need to learn so I can do it with y'all? Like. So you feel like they are more African? No, I don't feel they are more African. You don't? I feel like everyone who's come to America, either by force or by will, is American. Mm -hmm. Now, do I, I care to be called? Go ahead. I'm like, like I don't care. Like, I don't care if they... And I don't think that they could delete like my, the African part of my blackness, but I think all people originated in Africa. It's like a catch twenty two for me. For sure. So I feel like, like long term, I think that way too. I, I tell my daughter all the time that we're the original man. But I don't think think they can delete that part. Like you can't delete a part of a person just because. Or I don't feel like why. 
I don't understand the need to like make us like smaller or belittle a group of people by saying we're, uh, you know, African American or we're not African or we're not. Mm -hmm. Like, I, it's just weird. We are all black at the end of the day. That's how I look at it. That's how you look at it? Okay. We're all black. Now, we may like, have even different like people cultures. from like Nigeria, like Nigeria, like you feel like everyone, like everyone of this, you know. Everyone who looks black is black. Okay. I feel that. Now, we have different experiences. Of course. Sure. Mm -hmm. Um, unless you're an African. So this is where the conversation comes from. Unless you are a, a, a yes. African, mm -hmm. which is a different continent, mm -hmm. or you're a Nigerian, which is a different country, then I think that everybody else is just black. Everybody in America to me is just black, but we were scattered in different places, honestly. Yeah. Uh, but I do be saying Haitians and all these other people are more like African than us, but I think we're all just black. Yeah. Unless you are like an, an African. You know I had this mean? conversation with my mother-in-law a few weeks ago because her her nephews were discussing with Douglas. She's Jamaican, right? She is Jamaican. And um, her father, her, her father and her great-grandfather are, her great-grandfather is Asian, right? Which is even more of a like dynamic to her culture. But we were having this discussion and she said that since she's been in America, she identifies as black because she was brought here the same way that we were. She said, when they see me, I have an accent, but I'm a black woman. Me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, um, and same with her sisters and her mother. Like, they identify mm -hmm. as black women because they understand that they were, you know, like, they were brought here on a boat the same way that we were. We just in different places. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Um, but I will say that her, her, like, nieces and nephews, they, of course, see themselves as black, and they don't even get the point of this conversation. But I think my irritation is that, like, when we left Africa on them boats, Nigeria wasn't a country. When we left Africa, all of those island, all of those countries on the border weren't even there. Y'all were still deep in Africa in tribes. Nobody was Nigerian when we left here. Nobody was Senegal when we left there. I mean, I think to some there degree, were, I think there were some countries. There weren't as many as there are now, but some of those countries had already been colonized. No, no, no. When we left, so you know, we were taken from deeper inside of the country, inside of Africa, right? Inside of the continent and then brought to the borders. Mm -hmm. there, of course, there are already people living on the borders, but like literally these like established countries. No, they, that's what, no there yeah. weren't as many, but there were some. I think oh, Nigeria was on, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Was there wasn't though. as many Nigeria as- Nigeria wasn't formed It wasn't as many left. as it is now, but there were some because some places had already been colonized. Um, yeah, but that's not how they like stole millions of people because it was already colonized. For no, sure, no, there was no. like big huge cities and shit. No, I think people need something else to talk about. I don't really see this. I do sense. think that that it's pointless. I think that yeah, we would be a stronger people that. if we would just get over it. Don't get me wrong. At the end of the day, I agree completely that we should get over it. And I, I don't, don't like know why people idea. have to use. It's not even race because at the end of the day, we're all black. Why right. people have to use? Eth no, that's. This is not even ethnicity. Yes, yeah, ethnicity because we use ethnicity to like bolster themselves. Like, uh. I well, I don't know if it's no. They do. Bolster, they use it because they're oh, bringing they they're bringing ours down, like the black African men, whatever you call it. Mm -hmm. They're saying we're not this, right. and they have all of this. And so they they're have better. all of this. They right. have more connection. They have more culture. They have whatever the case because they feel like they are more well, directly so I, aligned. I, say, with their I don't African really marriages. actually get that from Jamaicans often. I don't live here though. You know, I don't know what the difference is, but I don't get the like. Oh, I don't get this from I'm anybody. Not, okay, I, oh, I only see this on the only internet. Gotcha. So I feel like only other country. So that's what I was saying is that for me, it's not necessarily West Indian people who feel that way. When in my experience, it's more or less people who are like Nigerian, like people who are, are I'm gonna say, actually from Africa, mm -hmm. because they, for some reason, see those places like actual African descendants versus mm -hmm. us. Like we're too American. Mm -mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. I'm gonna get back in bed, I guess. Mm-hmm. Wait, who locked me out of my room? I'm telling you, all these doors keep locking <laughs> by themselves. They sticking on us. They auto lock. What the fuck? That's it crazy. So yes, it feels good. It's so cold out there. My nips needed this one. It's so cold. It's so cold. I'm so cold. Because I got this ice box. That's what? this on. I didn't even mean to do that. <laughs> oh, what is this? You can close. You be buying shit, bro. Yeah. I do be buying shit. Did you say like, oh, I don't have any of this. Let me go buy some. <laughs> I was in Walmart because I forgot all of my. I couldn't find my toiletry bag. Oh, you really couldn't find it? I really couldn't find it. So I had to buy shit. She tried to do me like I didn't look. But I did. She did look. I did I, look. I didn't have a chance to look at him. Well, because well, Arnold told Kayla, was upstairs. Kayla pulled up at 4 o'clock. Yeah, I was about to say, how and did y'all end up leaving so early? Well, we, she was arguing for She wanted to be here by 8 o'clock. We got her stuff 57. 
She, she didn't want to so leave far. at eight o'clock. She wanted to be here by eight o'clock. But so I thought it was one hour away. So when you uh, say you want to be somewhere at eight, I'm thinking you're leaving six forty-five. <laughs> yeah. So when y'all called us and we still at Walmart talking about we're leaving now, where are y'all? We thinking what the fuck? It's four o'clock. Oh yeah, they realized one it hour away. So long. But no, it did take a very long time. Yeah, 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 y'all didn't realize. No, no, no. Yeah, so we, she was on time, and we got here at 7.57. Right. Well, no, what happened was, I hadn't packed yet. You know, I was waiting here. I hadn't packed yet. When, when you called, when you called Auntie and said she was coming, I said, oh, Brittany didn't get that nap. No, no, no. I had not patch it. You know, I'm, I'm late. Stuck so in that bag. I hadn't even packed. So I'm rushing around, throwing everything down. I go upstairs to get my underwear. Arnold, of course, wants to get frisky. Of course. And then Caleb was up. She called the phone, calling the phone. We in the act. <laughs> I love it. I love that. We're in the act. And um, she gets mad, whatever, whatever. <laughs> All right. yeah, but after that, then I had to hop in the shower. That's why I had to hop in the shower. And then I didn't feel right looking for the rest of my shit. That's why I have no socks. I had no toiletries. So I had to buy stuff. So I had to buy stuff. stuff. That's what ended up happening. That's that that is what happened. <laughs> Hello. 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 She wants to be behind the scenes, y'all. Gang, 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 gang. Yeah. Yeah. If I said it right here, would I be good enough? Or, or would I not? Would it be good enough? I, you know, I don't know how that's going. She called you trash with the camera. She called me trash with the camera. It looks dark, but I don't know if it's supposed to look dark. Happy birthday. That's Brit day. What could be happy Brit day? Oh, oh, that's what I was doing. That's what I was doing. She already too far and she gotta take it. Oh, she might have to take everything out. Well, okay. okay, it's gonna be worth it. What's it supposed to be? So you gotta get all fancy because I'm slow. I told you I'll get this before. Damn, I wish you had like a stapler or something then. Mm -hmm. You can this? go get the tape. That is for the balloons. Uh, Oh, them supposed to have a sticky piece in them. Yeah, they usually they do. don't. They, they don't. Oh, they don't? Uh-uh. They just don't care oh. about whatever party this is. Well, here, I can just do this. Okay, and then get some more garlic. Then so, you know, you have oh. 20 minutes. 30 minutes. They just shouldn't want to bring the plan not doing that thing. <laughs> oh it's just showing up and eating air. Oh, I gotta go to town. Oh, shit. What are you doing you know, with this, y'all? It's supposed to hang. You say, I gotta go into town. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta go into town, y'all. <laughs> Ain't that fucking crazy? Is it by the Walmart? Uh, it's in Hillsville, so I'm assuming. I didn't know this is where making was. No, make it to an hour away. Damn, make it to the hour away? Yeah. When I first moved here, I used to call it Macomb. Oh, my goodness. Really? I can see you. I'm like, are you from Macomb, that Macomb area? Yeah. They was like, what the fuck are you talking about? Oh, the holler. Naked nigga? I'm like, oh, my shit. It's not cold. Just like light on you or lift on you, is it light on you or lift on you? I think it's lift on you. Just say lift on you, yeah. It's lift on you. But who says it like that? But nobody says it like that. Who says it like that? Huh? That's how I pronounce it. Oh, okay. Everybody's not from here, Pam. Come on, Tosh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what they say in the active thing? Break a leg. She said, wait, speaking of New York, she told me to break a leg. I'm going to do my best wait, to get in the park. It's because right. I taped it. Ah, girl, you scared me so bad. This so then this part right? is supposed to okay. pan out. Like that? Mm. Oh, okay, sorry. Is that the what's going on? What do we need? The T and the H look is a little too. They close. That's all I'm trying to fix. Too happy together. Okay. Here, a couple. All right. But the V starts on this side. The Y ends on this side. Yeah. 
You need more tape? Yeah. Yes, yeah, fine. Yeah, I need more tape. I'm gonna take mine. Uh huh. You gotta cut it for him. So y'all be doing these big. No, this is good because they gonna fall. Another piece? Yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna stay here all day. <laughs> okay, now my piece. Can I see the little the, the scissors? The the scissors? Yeah. What I need from you is What you eat at? These scissors, uh oh. I'm gonna break this bait. Yeah, it's ready now. <laughs> it's easy. One, two, three. Understand this one. That was right. <laughs> All right. Um, we put that up here, right? Yeah. And then these are going over there or whatever. Wait, that is going over here? Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. I didn't even know that part. Okay, so it's some garland. It's some more garland. Like these little dots and stars. I don't know if you want to put those little stickies on themselves. Oh, the tape? I don't know if you want to take them off. So do you want us to love these little paper? We learned. This doesn't make any sense. It's supposed to have the sticky parts on the side. And then how does it hang? Like you hang it from this, right? You untie it. Right. But then when you untie it, look at it. Huh? You flip it out. Is there a picture? Yeah, I don't think they open it wide enough. So, so look at it. Then you try to open it. That's as wide as it goes. Well, it's supposed to, you're supposed to pull it out and make it to a ball. Yeah. Oh shit. It's supposed to turn to a ball like you poof it out. Like this? Oh, it's a puff ball. It's not a oh, okay. Always eating somewhere <laughs> and monitoring. Hey, I came all the way over here to hold this, and you still doing that? Okay, let me see. So you have. We, we're we're a little unorganized, but it's okay. But it's okay. You see how you see how that looks like it's not supposed to look like that, <laughs> but it does. <laughs> you know, it's just differently different. Okay, so <laughs> So it's not gonna be arched. Um a little. No, the stairs is weird too. Oh. Everything is weird about decorating this space because it's not. I mean we uh, okay, if y'all make it like this. Underneath Yeah, make it. No, no, above the happy birthday sign. What you mean? Like, kind of make it drape. Oh, no, then we need to bring the happy birthday sign in now. Oh, yeah. And you could, well, yeah. It's there, that's what I'm doing. They, um, I think this one had it. Because one is supposed to go on the happy birthday part? It's like some sticky part. It's a sticky plate. Come on, let's see how it looks over here. I know we don't want it over here because it's suggested, but this even still would be a cute picture. Yeah. That's too many balloons. Unless you and arch it. Breakfast. Give me a moment to be sincere, feeling this way.
always the top of the year Lately we've been real unsure, unclear Is it just me? Where do you go when you disappear? Tell me your secrets, you got my ear Room to assume is feeding my fear Okay, I don't have an answer to this question and I feel like I struggle with my faith a lot. Not like, not like believing, but I feel like sometimes I'm not like, quote unquote, like Christian enough because I'm like crazy scared of, I mean, yes. I'm getting more, but is that okay, no, wait, that's no, but I feel like, you know, it's just you're not supposed to fear and you're supposed to be excited. You're to not supposed to worry. Like all these things that they tell you. Just like that, yeah. Yeah, all, this, all these things that they tell you, you're not supposed to fear. You're not supposed to worry. You're not, especially by like when you're, when you're cool, you're gonna go be with the Lord and all that stuff. Mm -hmm. And I always I question those things. I'm, I like get nervous you about them. I sometimes experience yeah. those fears, and I'm like, does that mean that I'm not Christian? Does that mean I not have enough faith? Does that mean that I, mm -hmm. I'm like I'm not as strong in my faith as I think I am? Or so I don't really know how to answer this question. I really haven't found a way to like cope with that because every time I th like, I find myself like having a fear or thinking about something like that, I'm like, well, damn, maybe I'm not that Christian. I yeah. don't really know that thing. Okay. Not the big thing, so, but well, I'm not. I mean, I don't know. Yeah. Because I don't know, when you say Christian, or you put that, because everyone has that in any, mm -hmm. any faith. That's the difference between faith and religion. You're talking about Christianity, like that's a religion, but your faith is where, because you've been told that you can't question. But at the end of it, do you get solace by saying, I know it's going to be okay. Like, you just go through the yeah, motions. Yeah, I know it's going to be okay, and I don't doubt, like, what he does for me, and, like, him yeah. in my life, and what I see in his works. I don't doubt that. I just doubt yeah, myself you know, to do like that. within the constraints of religion you get what i mean because yeah, like i do struggle with that like i i recently got into like a i would say an altercation but a minor dispute <laughs> with a relative because you guys know i have anxiety and i struggle from depression and i take my meds like as mm -hmm. i should but this person said that i couldn't be a christian because in the bible it doesn't like people who don't have a sound mm -hmm. mind per se mm -hmm. can't be Christian. But God gave so, you the tools. That's just a tool. That's no, cool. I agree. But it, it became like a thing because it's like. And this is where religion ends. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, it's like a tricky thing. thing. See, yeah. but that's where that's where faith kind of. Yeah. I yeah. mean, religion yeah. kind of falls off. Falls off for me thing. because mm -hmm. I'm like. That's it. That's like, like she said, like it's certain rules. rules. Yeah, it's like, it's like certain rules. It's like, dang. How do we decide? Like, what's an abomination? Or like, what's a sex seriously? Yeah, right, yeah. In, well, like, a man decided like, because he wrote the book. Yeah. yeah. But I, after that conversation, I looked into it a lot, and it really made me feel like, oh, then I was questioning it a little bit more because there really are like several instances and situations in the Bible where mental health specifically is kind of like frowned so, upon or talked so about time, mental health. Are. But see, that's also, I mean, of course, I, I'm not a. Christian and I don't believe in the Bible but my point is even if I when I did mm -hmm. you have to look at it for the time that it was written in the Bible people that were written that mental health was like a disease of like leprosy it was just craziness they don't they didn't understand yeah, what you understand so now so you can't compare that to even put it in the faith that you have now mm -hmm. so your mental health is because of you know living in the world and you do it ultimately and girls were allowed to be girls if you were swooning swooning and fainting that blood they would cover women's eyes from blood mm -hmm. if we lived in those times exactly. we wouldn't be mentally ill for being overwhelmed as a mom we would be like oh that's just what happens you know women fall ill and that would be that the community would get you from fucking tea we would take care of the babies and you'd be fine and it wouldn't be a thing but we don't live in that type of community so i think that it changes the guidelines like you said like that's it well i know but as someone kind of who does believe in the bible and i try like you know we are far short but i try to mm -hmm. like i do believe what to be in the bible is true and so when I read things like that, or when I it, that is when well, I it still has to be left to interpretation. It's yes, yeah, definitely. So I'm not saying that you don't have to think it's true, but it still has to be left in interpret in, into some form of interpretation. Because are they talking about mental illness where you like on the corner and you can't get yourself together because you see zombies about to bite your face off and they're actually not there, or are they talking about mental illness that you are functioning through? So. They didn't, they didn't but I even that. think, even if I think about people with schizophrenia and people who have like, like severe mm -hmm. psychosis, I do not think that they don't know God. Like they literally are thinking they hear voices. Like, yeah, but that's I, I, I don't. I think that some of them do, and some of them don't. Just depend on the person. But I don't think that that automatically disqual like disqualifies them from Christianity or the Christian religion. Or I don't know. It's just it really. Y'all know. Like I go down a rabbit hole. Yeah. So when that was said to me, I really went down a rabbit hole. Really like exploring like mental health in the Bible and what it says as someone who has you know who deals with mental health i just really found it to be 
like triggering. Well, that's just I like a gay. I have a question. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. The person who said this to you, do you respect their opinion about other things? No. Okay, so don't respect their opinion. Nothing. I think I do. I'm hurt by it. I haven't talked to a in a year because of it. I'm very hurt by it. So I think I do. Oh God. Oh God. Oh, I think I do. But I'm saying, like I haven't spoken yeah, to her since like November. But it was also how she looks to me. And I feel about it also. So it has more to go with it. So I think I think I do respect their feet because you know it's hard for me. Like I'm not that. Get her another mimosa, please. You know. Oh, mimosa. Maybe don't get her a mimosa. You know, it's very few people that I not say that I don't value. It's very few people I'm that close to, like that I would go do anything for. You know. So when she said that to me, yeah, it really hurt me. Like it's so much so that I haven't spoken to her in a year because. And what prompted her to say something like that to you? She's been going through her own Christian walk. Yeah, and it was a, she, and so she joined a new chapter. Yeah, you know, yeah. she's she's learning because before that she okay. she was a non-believer and she's been going through her own Christian walk. And I understand yeah. and, and I and I understand like you need to get closer to God, then you remove whoever you need to remove. Like yeah, I don't also, see that yeah, issue. She put a lot more on it too. She didn't yeah. just say that. But she knows she's she, from her life. Mm-hmm. Well, she didn't speak to me for seven months and I didn't know why. And this is a person that I talk to her all the time. Like I drop everything that she needs me. I cry, cry, cry. I try to like this is the person outside of my sister. She is. She's. She was. Yeah, she's a sister to me. You know, and so and I and I know that you have to do whatever. Like I'm not above removing someone if it affects my relationship with God. I understand that concept and. And I and I truly and I've been saying that you know if that's what it takes to bring her to God, then it's fine. You know because I don't want to stand in the way of that. But it was just really hurtful because first of all, I don't really speak that openly about my mental health, and I even understand what she said is that like the spirit of depression, all that it can transfer, and I believe in that, and I believe that if someone is constantly like bringing their sorrows to you and bringing that energy to you, it definitely can. But you're in California. Mm-hmm. And when I'm talking to you, most of the time you're talking to me about your problems. Mm-hmm. I'm not even talking to you about what I have going on. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So it's not like I am bringing that spirit to you. Like that's just, that wasn't the situation. And I also felt like to me, I took it as like, yes, you're getting closer to God. And I think that's great. But if you are, it's nothing that anyone could tell me. To, it's nothing that anyone could have said to me to make, to make me it. just stop talking to you. And I mean, I was worried. I was calling. She has her own thing. I was worried about my guy kids. Like, I was worried. You know, I was calling like every day. See, I think that's what that all Trying that to figure is. out what's going on. And then when I finally talked to her, but they had to tell me the reason. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. It was extremely hurtful. And because mm-hmm. I do consider myself extremely religious. And then for that to be the reason. It just wasn't good. But it's after hurtful, that, and she shouldn't have said it to you because she was projecting her own feelings exactly, onto that's you. That's all it was. And her walk is very, very new. It's very it's new. It's like, she but even if she, she said that, that, but even if she had said, you know, I'm on this journey and I feel like I need to take some time, or you know, I just want to, you know, do this, and I, I would understand that. But, but to ignore me, no some people can't That's that you have to give her liberties too, because. Trust me, when you start your Christianity walk and where you in, it's it's a long journey, baby. She ain't gonna think the way she was thinking unless she's in some form of a cult, which I don't think so. Well, I don't know what you're you know what I'm saying, but it's yeah. going to work itself out That's not true. <laughs> because people always think that when they first go in, everybody is bad. Everybody, if you wear a short dress, you're now a hoe. Now I gotta wear dresses to my ankles. Trust me, I've been there. Anyway, we only have a question too. I didn't even get that. Okay. Okay. We're done with this. Okay. Exactly. We're done with talks with God for today. But, well, God gives you grace, so give yourself some grace. Amen. 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 All right, let's have music back go. I can't even have the two questions that I had. This is not for today. Let's talk to you. I'm sorry that you're I really do appreciate every person like who shows up for me. I try to do my best to show up for people, but then I don't have any expectations. Like I feel like it's important to show up for people without expectations. Like you know people like oh reciprocity, blah blah blah. I don't really 
to that that's like a fair concept i think you show it for people in the ways that you can and then that's it that's all you do as a person so if people don't show up for me i feel like okay they just can't show up in that way and that's okay like i don't take it as a bad thing but in the same breath i very much appreciate ah, the people who go the extra mile to show up for me i hope i'm making sense i hope y'all understand what i'm saying and maybe i'm not making any sense at all i don't know that was a lot of oil baby i didn't realize it was quite so much like that was a lot guys let me rub it on my hands just like taking a slow moment having a slow morning a slow time i feel like most of the time for my birthday it's like go 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 so i really wanted to take some time to stop and appreciate this at 35 to just slow down take a time a moment to appreciate life i also cannot believe i'm 35 guys i'm not gonna lie me being 35 is crazy i'm truly truly an adult and i don't understand how i became this way how did i become an adult Jump and risk the fall I see no limits in the sky Little by little here No, no Got stuck on working on myself Thought I was wrong and needed help But I'm just different something else No, little by little You gon' feel it. Okay. Let's we'll go back and rejoin the festivities. Who look like a big fluffy couch? Oh, because of her socks. It does she wear like a blue shirt like that? So you don't want to leave us. You don't. Be quiet. I tried to pressure Jay not to leave us to go to Cincinnati. He basically hates me. What time is your flight? Seven a.m. No, I gotta be there seven a.m. Oh, so you're gonna leave at like 5 a.m. I'm not going to do a straight to the airport. Why not? Uh, because I would like to actually go and sleep and get my stuff ready. I have none of my stuff. Like, you you should have brought all that. It's a party. This would be a better route to go to the uh, airport. Because mm -hmm. the whole thing is like, you know, 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 the whole thing is like, Mm -hmm. Wait, is he about to chop his head up? I thought y'all was watching something funny. Is this? this is morbid. No. Oh, girl. Y'all told me I was watching something funny like Nutty Professor. This got people sliding, people hits. No, this is my noise. Is this still funny? Black one. I don't watch stuff like that. I don't watch TV. Okay, I'm always telling about the shit you watch. I do not watch TV. I much prefer to read. Only TV I watch is Real Housewives. Kayla is still, Kayla is still watching Love and Hip Hop. I didn't know it was people who still keeping up with that. You watching what? What is that? What is that? What is from? Damn, I feel you, Kayla. I thought maybe it was your lady. I need to get some. Sorry, hurry up. I don't see I feel so accomplished. I will say I earned it. Oh, 
How you, where's it? I don't see another number. You don't see those two gold things in the middle? On the outside? Three and a zero? I was going to pray. Yes. Lord, we're going to pray for her. Because I'm in. You see? I got one more done if you want to take out. Oh, you only got that many hands. You want to put this in a cup next to you? Who, who I get with this to do these straws like Kate, uh, Tajas? Tajas. Oh, Tajas, come do your project. Taja, ain't this your project? And I know she would have been able to do it in the Nibians. Ain't this your project? What project? These wine glasses. Oh, yeah. Oh, those are so cute. Huh? What about them? Putting these things on these straws? Oh, this is Caitlin' idea. Is that everybody? That's enough. It is. Really neat. That's good. That's the magical number. I ain't trying to be the 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 decision maker here. As long as you do my video. So, are we, what do we decide? And I caught the port in today. Huh? I you put it in here if you want to mix colors and make it all colors. I'm not that. I can't mix. Now I did have to to my all colors. Y'all saw the death on my girl face. The death. Death. You gonna? She had blood in everything. She had colored shadows. Okay. We about to see who do the best. Oh, why did you get that one? Y'all, y'all talking, y'all. Well, these two ones, if you can watch it, I don't want those. Like that one. Yeah, I hate you for saying that. What? Artist, that you basically watch the final destination us. Y'all forgot I was announcing. I love it. Look, Saint versus sinners, the poor versus riches. Top ramen place versus five star dentists. Wonder why I fit it. The humblest beginnings. Had to take some losses before I saw my first winnings. Silver line grinning, poverty line thinning. My life is like a movie in the plot just thickened. Came from broken homes trying to break the old traditions. Left my old ways for my future acquisitions. I know. No such thing as playing both sides. I know. Life is better in the dope ride. I know. The water better in the low tide. Music better amplified. Staying down for upsides. I know. No such thing as playing both sides. I know. The life is better in the dope ride. I know. The water better in the low tide. Music better amplified. Staying down for upsides. I know. Coming from a family drunk cycle and it's belligerent Me, I sip a little bit, maybe a little more Just trying to keep a score Two cups in and knowing my liver sore And knowing I'm into sore And knowing I'm in for more Rewrite destiny right when I hit record Patching up the trauma, these lyrics is near spawn I rose from the concrete away but it came with thorns, I know I know, I know, I know, I know, I know I know, I know, I know, I know Thing is playing both sides. I know. You are your bar, Taylor? Yeah. But I added a hair piece. None of that. Oh, very cute, Stig. Oh, very cute, Stig. Kayla, you say something bad about mine. Oh, that's very good. Very good. Oh, that's good. Let me zoom in. Let me zoom in. I think it's very good. Oh, that's very good. Very good. Oh. We killed these wine bottles. We've really been on it. <laughs> Everybody even drinking the wine. Make that Gucci rain. Hands on your knees. Can y'all read this? It's 8 35 AF. Right. Oh, Chelsea. Everybody, Chelsea, you have to be by that. Like it's not small. You gotta be over here. Nine. Oh, you got nine. Eight. Wait, seven. Wait, is it three? Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Silly. <laughs> it's doing ten. 
I don't know. She talking about the game. Am I getting high because I've been drinking? I've been drinking. Watermelon. Yeah, the air be playing tricks, huh? Oh, you got an ice water. Auntie, you'll toss me an ice water. A cold water. All right, not with ice in it. Like, just a cold, not ice. You like any of them? Yeah, I was saying, I want to make him do it again, but then there's like a lot going on. Maybe we not. We didn't know we had 10 Did I get wet? Can you record me walk this food into you? Oh, I didn't even hear you. I was looking at get the pictures. Get your water. Thank you. Was that food for me? No, it really wasn't. So why you was recording me walking me some fake food? Why are you was recording fake food? Fake food is crazy. What the fuck? Walk me some real food and I'm gonna record the video. <laughs> With no tomatoes. What the fuck? Talk about can I record some fake walking food to me? <laughs> What the fuck? <laughs> I don't know. See that? I don't know. That just made me mad. Tyler, don't get up there. Tyler, don't get up there. Oh my god. Tyler, don't get up there. Tyler, get up there. Get up there. Come on, look at me. Oh. 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 If you didn't know, but I know you know, because <laughs> you've been watching this vlog. Everybody around me thinks that I'm crazy and is laughing at me. Yeah, I know you know. But I know, you know. I know you know because we're here. Y'all are my besties for real. We're about to turn 35. Tell <laughs> Show you better not tell Kayla that. <laughs> You're about to turn 35 in three minutes. Do you know you have three minutes? minutes? Three, three minutes. Yes, yes. Three <laughs> minutes. We're turning 35. This year sucked. So I'm looking forward to the next one. I feel like I didn't accomplish anything on my list. And that now I feel like I may have an even number of years in front of me. Because God says he'll give you 70. So I feel like I have to make the next 35 like the best possible. Amen. Won't he do it? He said he would. <laughs> Wait, are you up? We only have three minutes. How you sitting down? We got three minutes. Okay, but we need to at 12 at midnight. We have three minutes. Take a shot for me. Oh. <laughs> Take a shot for me. Whoa. Oh. Are we walking over there? Are we walking over here? We're going to go. You got it ready? 
Okay. Uh, take a shot for me. Uh, Y'all can't have a song playing? To wow. After the shot, take a shot for me. Oh, you spin the camera off? Yeah. Gotcha. So, comment down below. This is another one. Really? I follow Paige. That he makes cool. modular homes. Mm -hmm. so double wise be. Any uh, home that. Any well, it depends on the size. Double wise modular home. We're explaining yeah, the science of double wise, Tatasha. As long as it's double the size, it's a regular trailer, then it's a double yeah, one. Yeah, it's wrong with their setting down. It's a model. Yeah, it's a model. Yeah, it's a model. It's a trailer. 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 It's a Mm -hmm. You think it's done with foil and then you have to do the inside mm -hmm. as like material like a regular house. It's 1159. Okay, 1159. Do you know, Anson? Go get the set. You think we both need to carry over? Okay. Yeah, six She's shots. She's not bringing anything. So we're bring, are we bringing the shots over there? I am. We're bringing the shots over there. We have one minute. Okay, let's send the camera over there. Okay, you can have a shot. Take a shot for me. Okay, you record me with this camera, Kayla. Don't, don't film. Okay. Pussy, don't film me now. Sit this camera over there by that thing. Well, I, I gotta turn this nigga out. <gasps> Where you want You can't it? say that right there. You can't say the N word. Okay, face it towards me. Of course, Brittany, chill out. Oh, my cheek, look at her. Oh, look at that. And it wasn't nothing to it Looking up the shit, we about to make a movie Pouring up a cup, we about to set the mood in In the cup, rolling up, smoking something groovy I get excited when you're not biased Love is in my head, I won't stop trying I get excited when you're not biased Love is in my head, I won't stop trying Somebody that you love and well, oh well. It is officially my birthday. I'm 35. I'm getting ready to post. Last week vlog. Um, the water looks so peaceful. I'm gonna go sit by the dock today, I think. I'm sleepy, I think still. Just from the stand up all night. Last night we stayed up and did karaoke. Um, which is fine. Good morning, good morning. Keely, you got here super quick. Oop, they starting to fire. Hmm. Who's this? Oh, how? That must be somebody sick. How's. How's. What I say? They're hogs. Oh. Mm -hmm. Whatever. The house. That was close enough. You never said that before. Like she didn't say soft. No, no, I didn't say that. I really did not. I really did not say that. Yeah, stop. Soft. It's soft. It's set. Yeah, it's soft. It's soft. 
I don't know why y'all said it's sex. I don't know because my name is Jaquila on everything. Y'all do not even call me that. I don't know. They put Quante. But people call you Quante. <laughs> don't nobody call me Jaquila. You missing a button. Like the button I'm missing, I think she had a button. Do you need to put your wig on? Oh, no, no. It's morning time. No, I don't think you need to put your wig right on. I put a hat on because my leave out is left out a lot. <laughs> so I was like, I gotta wear my hat today because my leave out is so left out. It's not even funny. <laughs> it's outside. Man. I was like, let me put my fucking hat on. I couldn't even. I was, I, that that I, wore, I was looking at the stuff that I wore. I was looking at the stuff that I recorded yesterday, and I was like, oh no, bitch. <laughs> Look, I got like I had a hat on top of my head, like a big fat set. Like I'm like, oh no. <laughs> let me just put the hat on. Who we missing? She don't want to go call you know what Goddamn, TikTok. <laughs> no, I am going to make a TikTok, but not right now. Oh, okay. Maybe she'll come now. Maybe she knows about TikTok. It's a photo. Just a she, photo. She coming. Because all the pictures we took yesterday were not good. And Keela was an enemy. And I said, if Keela came back today, we had to do it again. Oh, she did say that. Yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Damn. But now Dang. 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 So you can stay right there, no, or you can come in. in. The other direction where our names are showing. Yeah, we could, but we got to come this way though, because we can't see you. You gotta be on this side. I can see Chelsea now, Kayla. I can't see you. What is this? What is this? What is this? We're I'm just making it so we can see everyone. We're just doing a picture. Yeah, it's just a picture. The picture we took yesterday was trash. No, go back on the side of Taja. We can see everyone. We gotta be lined up. Okay. We don't have to be lined up, but I'm saying if we want everyone to see, come in some. Look at your teeth. I used man yesterday. Oh yeah, let me fix these motherfuckers. Who cup is that? No, let's be lined up, I think. Right let's, yeah. let's be lined up, Hope, because I think that way I can see I was going to have to camera right there. Yeah, it's okay. No, my camera sees everybody. Stay next to Taja. Y'all get closer, though. Closer everybody here. get closer so that I can fit somewhere. I leave a big space for me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> With a big space. Yeah, I was about to say, like, here. Three, yeah, right there. Yeah. Okay, where's my big space for me? Right that's here. it. You, you think that's big enough? Okay, okay. Oh. Okay, like, if y'all think it's big enough for me. I want y'all to be like, no, I just don't. Okay. Is it 10 again? It's going to be 10 again. Oh, no way. 10. Oh, God. That's crazy. 9, 8, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Seven photos taken. Three to go. Okay. Okay, let's switch it up. Oh, sorry, Kaylee. Yeah, we missed out for two minutes. All right. Hold on, hold on. You're not going to do the clap? Wait, I'm supposed to clap. Wait, I'm in the front. Okay. Okay, one, two, three.
more and many more. <laughs> 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 Because I gotta do way too much to keep this store safe. So, I have made it home. I had a great weekend. I don't know exactly what I recorded and what I did record. Um, there was eventually some drama that ensued, but nothing that kept me from having like a great weekend. I really just wanted to spend my 35th birthday in peace and calmness and tranquility and one with nature. And I feel like I got to do that for the most part. We were going to have like a bonfire tonight, but we ended up coming home early um, because of said drama. But for the most part, I feel like it was a successful 35th birthday. Um, and I really enjoyed everyone's presence. Everyone. I enjoyed every single person that was there. I felt like they each brought a different dynamic. Um, I was going to talk to y'all about my goals for my 35th year, but I feel like I need to take the time to write them down. But I know a big thing I will just say, I will just say that I know a big, big thing for me this year is really going to be discipline. I really need to be disciplined because I left 34 feeling like I didn't do enough and I'm not leaving 35 that way. So discipline, I feel like it's going to be key. It's like... In my life, I've gone through phases where it ebbs and flows. I've had periods where I've been very, very disciplined, periods where I've been completely undisciplined. And I feel like when I am my most disciplined, there's literally nothing I can't do. And I'm really wanting to like hone into that. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this 35th birthday vlog. Yeah, I had so many mimosas, so much wine, so many drinks. I don't know what I did, didn't record, but... We'll see. As always, do make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on that bell notification so that you're notified every single time I post. And hopefully, I'll see you next week. If not, you'll see me on shorts. Rewrite destiny right when I hit record. Patching up the trauma, these lyrics is near spawn. I rose from the concrete away, but it came with thorns, I know.